Hey guys, so I am back with yet another girl talk getting ready with me. So I'm basically just going to film my makeup, talk to you guys, and you're going to watch. Pretty, uh pretty exciting. I know, but you guys, well, some of you guys liked this last time, other of you didn't. So, I'm just going to keep doing it for those who did like it, and hopefully the ones that don't will either like it or not watch it. So, anywho, let's go ahead and get started. Um, So, yeah. Uh, I'm going to tell you the products that I'm using, but I'm also just going to chit chat about my regular life because that's what I do. So, I feel like my style is like almost going away. Like, I feel like that every time though, so I really have no idea anymore. I'm all over the place. Um, I did moisturize. I've been using that Neutrogena Rapid Clear Moisturizer, and I'm liking it. It's, it's, it's nice. It works a lot like my, um, my whatchamacallit one, my proactive one, but that's benzoyl peroxide and the Neutrogena one is salicylic acid, which I think the Neutrogena one's a little more, it's more hydrating and um, it is a lot less harsh. It doesn't dry out my skin as much, so that's nice. But yeah, I've been soaking it. Um, it's Monday, by the way. Happy Monday. I, this weekend, really did like nothing. I studied. I finished my puzzle that I've been working on forever. If you guys want to see what I'm talking about. Vlog channels linked down below, like always. Um, I've been vlogging more often too, you guys. I've been vlogging probably like two times a week I've been trying to upload. I mean, <clears throat> well, I've been editing. That's what I've been doing because they don't all fit in one vlog a week anymore because I've been vlogging so much. I'm a crazy vlogger. Anyways, I'm using my uh, Maybelline Shine Free Stick con Foundation thing. This is my first time using it again since Friday because I didn't wear makeup at all this weekend because I did nothing. I cleaned out my closet though, you guys. I have like three bags of clothes to give away. And um, I don't know if I told you, I told my vlog channel, but um, I'm going to use that. I'm going to go to Play-Doh's and use whatever money they give me and I'm going to double it and that's what I'm going to use for my... Um, clothing budget for uh, spring and I mean for fall and winter so yeah I don't really need to buy that much because I don't like need a jacket or anything because clearly I'm in Florida so it doesn't get that cold so um yeah I just want a couple of new things but I had to get rid of some old to get new and that's like a, a definite recommendation that I can make for you guys is if you're like Wanting to spend, if you want to buy clothes, but like first of all you have like no room in your closet and you just like don't need clothes, get rid of some old ones, but you want new ones because you know, you just want new ones. That's a good way to justify it. That's how I did. So I put this back in my little baggie because, hello, Bella chewed it. If you watched my FIF, you saw that. I'm just going to go in with a little bit of extra concealer, my um, Laura Mercier undercover pot. I'm using my Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder and this is in the color Silky Beige with my e.l.f. Kabuki. Um, so I went on a run this morning. I went on a run yesterday too, but I'm going to try to do runs. Um, you guys can hold me to it. <laughs> Monday, Wednesday, and Friday because that's when I don't have class until 11.30. So I don't need to leave here until 11, which means that I, you know, and I try to wake up around 8 o'clock every day. So I have like two, three hours to do stuff. So on days when I don't like have a lot of homework to do and whatnot, I would like to do a run. So I went running today, about a half an hour run, just around the block with Bella. But Bella does not keep up during our runs. She's kind of slowing me down. So if she continues to slow me down, don't pick up the pace, then homegirls get in the boot. I'm using my e.l.f. Um, blonde bronzer blush contouring blush and bronzer palette and a Bare Minerals brush for some bronzer. Okay. So let's talk about boys, because <laughs> you guys know I like to talk about that topic. Um, anyways, oh well, let's talk about the rest of the, my weekend, though. I did go out to dinner with Lisette on Friday night, and then we came back and just hung out. So I don't know what happened, but my camera just turned off. So sorry if I, like, was cut off mid-sentence. So I wanted to talk to you guys and get your opinion. I know this is, sounds kind of stupid. Um, by the way, I'm using my Revlon Brow Fantasy. Um, so... Um, so that's all I say anyways. I think, oh, I'm going to Miami this weekend, so that's exciting. But also, the following weekend 
is not Lisette's birthday. The following weekend after that is Lisette's birthday. Uh, but the following weekend, which is like the 5th, the weekend of the 5th, which is a Saturday, I believe, I think, uh, my ex-boyfriend who I, um, do you, I don't know if you guys remember from the beginning of the, of time when I started making videos, not like when I started making videos, but like what, two years ago, a year and a half ago, I, um, was dating this guy and he moved away and I was visiting him for a while and then things just didn't work out. He lives like three hours away in St. Augustine, well Flagler Beach, but that's near St. Augustine if you guys are familiar with that area. And he asked me, we've been like talking a little bit, like just not like talking, talking, because I don't, I don't know. But he asked me if I wanted to come down and visit. He just like bought a new piece of land and all this stuff. I don't know, whatever. I'm like deciding of whether I want to go visit or not because I'm worried that things are going to not go the way I want them to or they, I don't know. The last time that we hung out, I was hoping... It was, I feel like it was so close to our, the, 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 the bleh, I cannot speak, the time that we broke up that, I don't know, I feel like I was really sad and I was hopeful that we were going to get back together, even though I didn't think I wanted to get back together. I don't know, my brain is retarded. Um, I'm using the Neutrogena Fresh Healthy Skin Blend in Fresh. Uh, it's a blush, pink blush, with my Sephora Airbrush 55. So, yeah, I was like, ooh, deciding of whether I really want to go or not. I haven't decided completely yet, but I'm worried that it's not going to go the way I want it to and that I'm just going to be mad at myself for going there and wasting my time. And, and the thing is, I don't think I want to get back together anyway, so what's the purpose of going there? Do you know what I mean? Because I don't want to go get back together with him because I really like the way my life is right now and when we're together I don't really have my own life because it's sad but true but I want to visit him every weekend or be with him every weekend and it's nice to get out of Tampa and go there because I really like it but then I'll lose all my friends because of the friends that I've gained here and I won't have like that college experience and all that kind of stuff that is just like my own that I lose when I, you know, when you date someone that lives freaking three hours away, so, I don't know. Oh, I just applied my Hard Candy So Baked Bronzer in Tiki. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I still haven't decided. I've got a little bit of time, but we'll see what I end up doing. Let me know in the comments down below. Most of you are probably going to be like, girl, that's a bad idea, because that's what Lisette said. And I know it's a bad idea. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I'm using my Urban Decay Potion Primer. I'm actually going to use eyeshadow today. So I have had the weirdest dreams lately, like dreams where I feel like I'm going to get like kidnapped or robbed or something weird like that, and I don't know why because, like, I think it's because I've been watching, like, Dateline murder shows lately, and it's like, I need to stop because I, like, scare myself. And I've been, like, waking up from dreams in the middle of the night. And you know how, like, you wake up and it's, like, hard to go back to sleep? That's what I've been dealing with. And it's, like, I need to stop doing that because I need my sleep. I'm going to be using my Urban Decay Naked 2 palette. And I never use this thing because I just never do. I'm going to use Booty Call, which is, like, a light shimmery color all over my lid. I saw um, Hot Brilliance do this look in her... Um, homecoming makeup look so I figured I would just try it not like as intense because I'm not a uh, going to a dance but I never wear eyeshadow so I figured I would wear a little bit today so while I was cleaning out my closet yesterday I found a lot of stuff that I am excited to wear because you know how you like forget or like the biggest thing for me is that I will like have pieces that I wear a certain way and I no longer like that look anymore on me or, you know, my style has just changed. But then I, like, can realize that I can <clears throat> style them a different way and then I like them again. So that's what I was doing last night, kind of just trying on my iffy clothes. And I ended up liking a lot of them. So, but I still am giving, like, three bags away. Three full big Hollister bags full of clothes. So I'm excited. I don't really know exactly what I want to get for fall related. I really want to get... A pair of maroon pants 
And I have a pair of black boots from Target that I want in brown. So those I know I want. That's what I know I want so far. So I'm just putting T's in the crease. So I thought I would answer a question that a lot of you guys have been asking me lately, which is, what happened to Crystal? And if you guys watch my vlogs or watch like my best friend tag or anything, you guys will have seen Crystal. And, oh, I'm putting YDK just on the outer little half of my eye. So um, Crystal was like one of my best friends. Oh my gosh, did you guys hear that noise? That was outside, I thought that was inside. Um, anyways, so Crystal's one of my best friends as well as with Set. We were all really good friends. And then Crystal got a boyfriend. And you know those girls, and I'm not hating. Like, whatever she wants to do, she wants to do. I'm just sad because I miss her, Abby. Um, but you know those girls that, like, get boyfriends and then they, you just, like, drop off the face of the earth because they think you're, like, a bad influence or... I'm sorry, I'm saying this in a mocking tone. But it just, like, frustrates me that she just, like, literally fell off the face of the earth when she gets a boyfriend. And I'm just like hate people that do that but whatever I don't hate people that do that I just hate when that happens um so that's what happened to Crystal if you guys are wondering I miss her too so I would tell you go blow up her Instagram but she deleted it so can't really do that I put in busted on like a small angled brush and I'm just like smudging that into my lash line so what are you guys gonna be for Halloween um I haven't decided what we're being I think okay so I have <clears throat> a Halloween party, like a family Halloween party. I'm using my CoverGirl Lash Blast and my um, CoverGirl Lash Perfection to do my, my mascara. <clears throat> but I have a Halloween party that is my friend Maria's. So we're going to go to that on the 19th. And then, oh, I really want to go to Hollow Scream too. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go to that. And I think we're all going to dress like a three of a kind. So I think we're going to dress as like the three musketeers or... Three Blind Mice, we haven't decided, or the Disney Princesses, we haven't decided. So we're doing that on the 19th, and then we're probably going to go to like a house party and stuff like that. I haven't decided what I'm going to be for that yet either. Um, so let me know what you guys are going to be down below. When I was a little kid, we used to have this big, it was called the Boo Barn. It was a um, Halloween, like a haunted house in our garage, but our barn was like huge because we lived in the country. And, oh, I loved doing that. That was so much fun. Then our barn burned down, so that wasn't fun. But that's what I did every year for Halloween when I was a little kid. It was so much fun. And then as soon as Halloween's over, I'm ready to decorate for Christmas. <laughs> like, I'm ready. I love my house decorated for Christmas. It's just really cute and... Let me know if you guys want to see, like, a house tour of when I decorate. That could be kind of fun. I feel like I always look like a clown with my with my blush on in the in this camera. I swear, guys, in life, I don't look like a clown, but I feel like in this video I do. One more guys here. So mascara is done. <clears throat> I'm getting over a cold. Yikes. Anywho, chapstick, bird's bees. And then that's like it. I don't know what I'm going to have for breakfast. Hmm. I set my Urban Decay makeup setting spray. Figure out what I got to wear. Ta-da. Do any of you hate when you just do your mascara and then you like sneeze and it gets all over the place or you have to cough or something? That like always happens to me. Anyways, you guys, that's my completed makeup look. This is what I'm wearing today. Thanks for getting ready with me. I gotta go do this mess of a hair, get dressed, eat breakfast, and head on my way to my day of class and yada, yada, yada. But I'm feeling pretty energized because I went on a run, so I'm like ready to take on the world. So I love you guys. I hope you all have a wonderful Monday, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.